So um, we're talking again about Mel Martin. We uh, spoke about him in the last video as well. This is another ad written by him. And it's also a boardroom ad. Boardroom is the, the company that uh, employed Mel Martin, amazing copywriter. And um, I'm going to talk here about the layout. Sometimes in these newer ads, I find that the um, graphic designers want to make the ad look pretty and then you can't really read the text easily. Uh, if you look at this headline, it's kind of a long headline. It starts here with the word uh, at the top left uh, with the word for and then it ends here with the word school. So what did they do to make it um, easier to read? They put the beginning of the headline, in the beginning of the headline, they put the most important information and it's in all caps and it's bold type. Then the next little bit is not in all caps, it's in normal, lower caps, still bold, and then they lower it further to no bold at the, at the end. So you go from big to small, from bold to regular, um, and then that way uh, your eyes sort of follow um, the structure of the headline. So we have at the top, for adults who would love to pick up their education where they left off. So that in itself could be the headline, standing alone like that. But then we have an, ad, uh, an added uh, line that says, or start again in the right direction. And then another added line that says, no matter how long ago they graduated or got married or got a job or got drafted or quit school. So um, really clever way to uh, break up a, a long headline. And I think that the, the trick is to put the most important information in the biggest type, obviously. So at the beginning in this case. But actually you could do it differently. I have seen it where uh, they put a little bit, they start at the top with smaller type, then the middle of the headline is bolded and bigger, and then at the end you have, um, again, smaller type. So I've seen it done different ways. Um, and then another masterful uh, uh, layout um, component is these numbered bullets. Yeah, uh, they're not very long. They're, they are really small and easy to read and they all have promises. So number one tells you which accredited colleges and school and schools will teach you what you want to learn. Wow, that's a big promise. Second bullet says, which ones, talking about schools, right? Which ones are near to where you live or work? So very, very relevant information. So a person that wants to study can now sort of um, screen the schools for what they want to learn, for the location where they want to study, and so on and so forth. So really relevant information. So these copywriters in the past, they did a lot of research. They would sit down with these books and they would read them and reread them and make notes about them and quote the book in many places of their ad. Um, in this particular case, we don't have page numbers in the bullets, yeah? Uh, why is that the case? Because the information appears in many places in the book. So let's look at bullet number one. It says that the book is going to tell you which accredited colleges and schools will teach you what you want to learn. So Mel Martin doesn't know exactly what you want to learn and it doesn't know exactly which accredited school you are going to be interested in. 
so he can't give you a page number for the fascination but if you look in my previous video also about Mel Martin you will see that very often for these bullet points for these fascinations he would put a page number and that that was very powerful now here you don't have the page numbers but the promises are very easy to understand very straightforward and super relevant to what a person would want to know certainly a person would want to know which schools teach what they want to study that person also wants to know if there's a college near them also bullet number three which classes you know offer you know evening work or family schedule or whatever yeah number four what requirements you have to meet you know to get into the schools so really um, very well written ad super to the point I uh, you know this this is pre internet right so this would have been a, uh, a gold mine for a person that was trying to go to college uh, back before the internet very interesting ad uh, guys if you want to sign up for my email newsletter and I will give you a free book free ebook look in the description there is a link for that ebook that I have um, and please contact me if you have any questions